Hi, thanks for watching my video today. My name's Sarah Berry and I'm going to talk you through how you go about purchasing your starter kit and joining Stampin' Up! and becoming one of my demonstrators in my Strawberry Stampers demonstrator team. Now you will have probably had a phone conversation with me or an email conversation and this is basically the next step so I'm going to show you the next steps all you need to do is just watch my cursor over here on the right and I will show you the direction in which to go via my website I'll just quickly say that you can join if you are living in the UK if you're in France, Germany the Netherlands or Austria so we welcome anybody in those countries that would like to join okay so you can see you're at my blog which is stampwithsarah.co.uk and if we scroll down there is normally a join at the side here so you can go on to there or you can navigate to the join page by clicking the fourth one along at the moment um, with a star next to it that says join okay so the page opens and we have some information about joining now I'm assuming that you've already read this so I'm not going to um, read it to you at the moment so we just want to click on build your starter kit now so when you do that and um, I should say that you can do this on a PC on a Mac and also uh, a tablet such as an iPad so when you click on that link it's my own personal link so you will find my name at the top here Sarah Berry if you're having any problems or you need, a, you need, to, uh, need to ask me a question my phone number is there and also my email so this is called the online IDA so that is the independent demonstrator agreement what you need to do is read over these agreements and then just click acknowledged in the right hand side here this is just a standard ag um, agreement that you're entering into um, some kind of contract I would I, I imagine um, that's the best way to describe it and in here there's basic things um, such as your right to um, to cancel um, that you can't represent another craft company you can't sell on um, sites such as eBay just that kind of thing but have a good read of it it applies to everybody that wants to join not just to become a demonstrator but that wants to purchase their craft supplies with a discount there's many people that join for different reasons you can join to make it a business like I do or you can simply join just as a hobby you probably buy quite a lot and have suddenly thought I'd really like some discounts so this is a great way of um, this is a great way of getting that discount you this is like having a membership to stamping up without having the commitment but you can take it where you want to go you can do the odd craft um, craft show or craft class have people around in your house in your home it really you can do what you want with it so once you've taken the agreement um, you click the agreement you click continue and then you just choose your starter kit value now the current promotion which is on until the 31st of March is 160 pounds of product for 99 pounds so that is what we see here you just want to click the radio button here on the left after March, after the end of March, this will go back to our normal um, starter kit deal, which is £130 of product for £99, which is still an amazing deal. Um, this all is sent to you for free, 
which is another um, £4.95 if you're in the UK for pounds. Uh, I think it's five ninety five um, if you're in euros. So um, it's another saving. Now you might have had a workshop with me. Um, that's just an email. We'll ignore that. <laughs> there we go. Thank you, inbox. Okay, so you may have had a craft party with me, and you will have a um, a hostess code. So if you do have one of those, you just want to click yes, and then enter the code, and then click apply. If you don't, and um, probably won't have one, you just click no, and then you still have to click apply. Then number two, just click the radio button again. No, that oh, it's gone down. That is a free business supplies pack, which is about forty-five pound in value. And where I when I mentioned that you can take this and really run with it, um, and with me, phone call. Hang on. Okay. Um, when I mentioned that you can really run with it and start your own business, start your own crafting business, you get a free £45 business supplies pack in with your starter kit. So that includes things like order forms, leaflets to give out to potential customers or recruits, um, you have a pack of catalogues, um, you receive a pack of catalogues for the current um, promotion that we um, the current catalog that we have um, that also includes um, like spring summer catalogs or autumn winter catalogs if you're joining when we have that on okay um, I think there is a DVD I'm not too sure whether they've transferred that onto an online video now but there used to be a CD or a DVD um, let's just see what it says on here yeah, so this is just a, um, a picture to show you what um, you've received. Now the picture is is old, but that doesn't um, it doesn't mean you get the old items. You do get current things. So once you've clicked that, um, number three, build your starter kit. So this is great. So we just click on this box here, and if you have the item codes, which I'm just going to find one now, you can type it straight in. So I'm going to put down um, the curvy corner trio punch which is 139683 and then click search and then it pops up a nice picture of it so you know that you're ordering the right thing. You can click add and then it drops down into your basket here. The really clever thing is, it takes that cost of the punch there, which is £18, away from your £160 value that you have to spend. So it will tell you, you have £142 remaining, or whatever it is that you enter. So, if we'll start, um, we'll carry on actually putting some things in. So I'm just going to take what I've got here. Okay. So always remember to click add, or you can actually click return again. So it's very easy. You can also, in this box, use it as a search. So if I put in, um, let's try ink pad. Anything that has got those two words in it, or might be related to that, like an ink refill. Um, will come up so you have lots of different pages you can filter it so I know an ink pad is between um, 0 to 10 pounds and I'll just you can filter high to low if I put classic in oops that will probably bring up there we go some ink pads here so you can do that you can also search by price. So if you get down to say five pounds remaining and you're not sure, you can um, filter 
the price so or maybe you get down to like two pounds so you can see here we have um, some washi tape which is very nearly two pounds so you can add that in um, so that's it really that's all you do so just bear in mind that you can't go over 160 pounds or the 130 pounds that it is normally and the reason for this is the system it just doesn't take the difference um, so if, if it was five pound over it wouldn't be able to take that five pounds and the idea is that you have to stop somewhere we could all go a little bit crazy and buy and buy and buy for our starter kit so it was capped at that price and also you want to save all your items on your wish list for your future stamping up orders as a demonstrator because you will get your 20% discount so try and get as close to that retail value as possible alright so I'm just gonna see if it will let me click no it won't let me click through so I'm just gonna add some um, items quickly now and go right down there we go nice paper snip Get some more blender pens I have lots of blender pens <laughs> 2855 10 pounds 55 okay so I have 1 pound 55 left I don't think I don't think there's anything for that no okay that's fine so I'm happy with that I do have some people on my team that I've actually got it bang on 160 pounds which is amazing um, or like 20 p away or something so I set you the challenge of uh, of getting as close to that as possible so once I've clicked next or um, I think it was continue this is where you enter your personal information so I don't need to tell you what that is but just start typing okay and uh, once it's all filled out um, you for your personal information you then go to click your shipping address so this is the address you would like your starter kit to be delivered to if you would like to get it sent to a work address this is the place where you'll put your work address then, then bear in mind if you do put in a work address or um, a family member's address if you're not going to be in to receive your parcel you will need to enter your own mailing address on this side so that is the place where you you live or most importantly the place where your um, either your credit card or your your debit card whatever card you're paying on wherever that is registered to you would need to put that in the mailing address okay so just do that by clicking that little checkbox there um, if you are registered for VAT um, it tells you what to do there but um, it might not apply uh, and also you can have your spouse as a supporting demonstrator and it explains what that is to the side there so in summary it just tells you at the bottom who you who you are signing up with and that is me and it won't let me go any further because I've not filled out all the, the forms but if you have forgotten something it will notify you so the next screen would just um, review what you're having and um, that's it send it off and it takes oh sorry no it reviews what you're having and then you have to put in your um, important numbers for your your credit or your your debit card and that's it make sure the email address that you I've just noticed that I can't spell Elizabeth and you all now know what my middle name is um, so what was I saying yes so it will um, it's important that you put in the correct email address because you will be sent uh, three possibly uh, four emails and this will tell you what your demonstrator login will be to the Stampin' Up! website I'm going to do another video to tell you what you do when you get that ID code and also your password so um, thank you very much for watching. If you are joining, I'm really happy to welcome you into the team. I have lots, um, I have lots of people in the Facebook group. We have a, our own private.
private Facebook group. So I'll be sure to welcome you into that and send you a welcome email and a welcome pack very soon. Thank you very much for watching and if you have any questions you know how to contact me. Thank you. Bye bye.